Today's math lesson is about symmetry. I can identify if an object is symmetrical. I can create a symmetrical design. Do you know what the word symmetry means? Symmetry is when both sides look the same. The lines, shapes, and colors are the same on both sides. So if you look at your picture right here, you can see that the line is straight down the middle and on this side and this side, it's the same. Same with the rainbow and same with the butterfly. An object is symmetrical when it is exactly the same on both sides when you fold it in half. Things like shapes, letters, insects, numbers can all be symmetrical. So if you look at these things on the side, you can see where there's a, an imaginary line that shows you that they are the same on both sides. Can you think of any objects that are symmetrical? What about your face? Is it symmetrical? Like if you put an imaginary line down the middle of your face, would it be the same? So if I had this design that I made with pattern blocks and I was told to make a symmetrical design, remember that means the same, I would want oops, to build my design like this because you can see that here's that imaginary line and then their shapes are the same on both sides. So it is symmetrical. Let's look at this flower. It is symmetrical because if there was a line down the center, you would see the same thing on both sides. So let's look at some items and decide, is it symmetrical? The snowflake, what do you think? Is it symmetrical? Yes or no? So if we put a line right down the middle, would you have the same thing on both sides? Yes. What about this kite? Is it symmetrical? If we drew a line right down this way, would it be the same on both sides? Yes. Is it symmetrical? No, because the candies are different colors all throughout the bag. So if we folded that in half, they would not be the same. What about this dog? If I put a line right here, would he be the same on both sides? No, but I could put a line down his face and it would be the same, but not the whole dog. What about this flower? If I put a line down the middle, would it be the same? Yes. Now, can you find something around you that has a symmetrical design? So something that you could draw a line down the middle of it and it would be the same on both sides? Can you go find something? See if you can. You can pause the video if you need to. All right, so let's look at these examples. Which shapes are not symmetrical? Which means you could not fold them in half and they would be the same. This orange one and the yellow one. Now for your assignment today, you are going to be drawing in the designs of a butterfly that are symmetrical. So you're gonna look at this video right here and what you wanna look at is you wanna see how the person drawing this is doing a design on one side so you see here that she has first drawn three circles on the top and the bottom. And now on the other wing, she has to do the same thing because that's what symmetrical means. It's the same on both sides. So she's got to do the three dots on the top and the three dots on the bottom, just like she did for the other side because that's what symmetry is. So let's take a look at these butterflies. So this one right over here, you can see the designs they chose to make. Now, in order for it to be symmetrical, they had to do the exact same thing on the other side. So I have three dots down here and three here. Same pattern. 
Let's look at this one right here in the middle. Same thing. If I use pink on the top wing, I need to use pink on the other top wing. And so the top and bottom wings can be different from one another, but when you look across the center, so right here, they must be the same. Same with over here. There's a dot and there's a dot, and then same with the bottom wings. Remember, when you draw your butterfly, you need to draw use the same colors on each side. So if I do pink on one side, I have to do pink on the other.